Hi, it's May and welcome to the Tuesday Tech Tip. This week I want to show you about the new autofill uh, abilities in Safari, which is really a great way to save yourself time and the kind of frustration that working on the internet can cause. So I'm going to open up Safari here, go up into the word Safari and go to Preferences. And then I'm going to go here to the third section, Autofill. And basically this is saying, which of these autofills do you want to use? So when I'm filling out forms, I can say use the info from my contact card and I can go there and edit it. And you can make sure that it has the correct information that you want when you're filling out forms on the internet. So sometimes you might have a different email address that you use when you fill out forms, maybe one that you only use for subscriptions. You might have a different phone number that you use. You might put your work phone number, not your home phone number. You might put your work address. So just make sure that this form, that this card is filled out in the way that you want it to be filled out when you uh, do things on the internet, when you're ordering things or subscribing to things. This next section is usernames and passwords, and right now this is empty because I've deleted them all, but when I go into a website uh, and I say save my information, it will save it right here so that the next time I go to that website, I don't have to remember the password that I set up, which is really a time saver, a great time saver. If you do this though, make sure that you have a password on your computer. Um, because otherwise anyone who comes into your computer when you're not there can go and get onto any website that you go on and, and, uh, do whatever they want, probably look at your email and stuff like that. So just make sure that you're aware of, um, this is a great tool, but it's also, uh, can be misused. Uh, credit card. This is a new one, which is great. You go in here, this is fake information, but you go in here and you just click add and you get the name to the card, the card number, the card holder, and the month and the year, and done. And when you're going to fill out forms to buy something online, you don't have to go pull your credit card and look it up. It's right there for you. Again, please make sure you have a password on your computer. And other forms, um, these are other forms that you've saved on the Internet from before. Um, and so anyway, that is how to use uh, autofill in Safari and it can make your life a lot easier. I hope that was helpful and thanks so much for stopping by.